17 addresses the number 3 Augie wishlist request by increasing the default size of some dialog boxes and allowing you to resize others. With these enhancements, you can view more information with less scrolling. For example, you can stretch the Layer States Manager to display more layer state information at one time. You'll find similar enhancements to the Page Setup Manager, Enhanced Attribute Editor, the Insert dialog box, and many others. And there are other subtle enhancements to many of the dialog boxes. For example, in addition to the ability to stretch the Insert dialog box to increase its height and width, it displays a larger preview image. And the Name field now supports Autocomplete, so as you begin typing a block name, it automatically fills in the rest of the name, minimizing the need for you to scroll through the list. Another example is the very subtle addition of U.S. survey feet to the insertion scale list in the Units dialog box. Another subtle but handy enhancement is the message which displays if you try to delete selected objects using the Delete key when the Pick First system variable is set to zero. You can avoid displaying this message in the future by selecting the option to always perform your current choice. Doing so adds the Delete key message to the hidden message settings which you can access from the System tab of the Options dialog box. Tooltips can be very helpful for new AutoCAD users or even to help veteran users identify those tools they don't use very often. A new control on the Display tab of the Options dialog box lets you tailor the tooltip display to meet your needs. If you rely heavily on them, you may want to decrease the number of seconds before display so they display quickly. If you rarely use tooltips, try increasing the number of seconds before display. This allows you to take advantage of tooltips when you really need them without the distraction of displaying them when you don't. The HP system variable and corresponding ribbon control enables you to automatically create new hatches on a specified hatch layer regardless of the current layer. In AutoCAD 2017, the HP layer system variable has been enhanced so that you can create a layer that doesn't yet exist in the drawing and set it as the hatch layer in a single operation. The text edit command includes a new mode option that allows you to edit multiple text objects without having to restart the command. When the multiple option is selected, text edit repeats so you can continue selecting text objects for editing. An undo option within multiple mode lets you undo previous editing operations.